steps up to the starting line. You see him there. We've got uh, Brom Culver from Front Range, Isaac Armstrong from Team Illini, Jake Taylor of the Stallions, Sean Cook, Vaden Skogrand, Garrett McDonald, and top qualifier in this one is Jaden Coleman out of Skater's Choice Speed Club in Pensacola, Florida. So Jaden Coleman. People who are new to the sport would have a chance to compete with uh, other rookies and get a chance to see where they are compared to uh, other folks who have just gotten started. And you see there, he knows it. Garrett McDonald from Smoky Mountain Racing in Tennessee. So McDonald wanting to get that little extra jump on Coleman there at the line, but it costs him. So there's the yellow card for the skater in Volunteer Orange. And off they go, and it is McDonald shaking off the false start, and McDonald out in front early as Coleman and Skogrand give chase. So McDonald out to the early lead. Coleman now right on his hip. So it's McDonald, it is Coleman, it is Skogrand running third. But it's McDonald and Coleman. One, two, as Coleman slides around the inside of McDonald and takes the lead, just approaching the halfway mark. Coleman now out in front, McDonald following behind. Coleman and McDonald still running one, two. Skogrand staying in the picture looking for an opportunity to gain some time as Coleman and McDonald continue to battle, one, two. Halfway done now, Coleman still leads McDonald as they begin to overtake some of the rest of the field. That was Culver from front range we saw briefly. So Coleman, McDonald working to stay in contact. The winner gets in automatically. Second place, the pace these two are running looks very good, but it's not guaranteed. The only guarantee is to win, and Coleman uh, seems to have taken that to heart as he has, in the course of just the last lap, opened up about a second and a half advantage. So McDonald conceding the race here as Coleman's on the bell. The bell lap for Jaden Coleman, the man from Pensacola. Going across the line, standing up, and he is through. And you see that <clears throat> there just how far McDonald fell off. In fact, it looked like Skogran might have jumped up and uh, and clipped him there for second place. We'll have to see what the official numbers look like as the rest of our competitors round out this contest. Let's see what. Uh, those final times did end up looking like for the rest of the field running behind Coleman. So McDonald did hold on there for the for second place with a 150. So he looks good. Vaden Skogrand.